No, that one might be. This is a cast. I did that earlier too, but finally. Uh, yeah, that one nailed it. Man, I was barely moving it. This is a good one. I was barely moving it. I think it's a good one. They fight good in here too. I don't know. Barely moving it, huh? Uh, yeah, I was like just. This might be a good one. I don't know. Uh, they feel good in that current. Uh, they're weird, man. Like, they're different here. I don't know how to explain it, but they're genetically different than any other walleye. Ah! Look how thick he is for a little guy. That belly. We got, we got all the cameras on. Yeah. Give it a little squeeze. Put that right there. Yeah. There we go. Finally. What is up, guys, and welcome back to another episode. Today, I'm fishing the Ohio River for walleye again, and I'm out here with the boys from Cast Cray Outdoors. We got Rick over there. We got Jay. We got Rick Jr. And we're out here trying to catch a couple. We actually got a couple on the stringer already. It's been a little slow. Uh, we kind of had to wait our turn to kind of get into the good current break to where a lot of the fish are stacked up. If you're outside the current break, it can be really tough. There's like a little current break up there. There's a nice little current line right through here. And we're just kind of cast into the current line. A lot of those fish are just hanging out right on the edge of that. But like I said, we're finally in the right spot, so we should start catching a lot more fish. Um, beautiful day out here. It's like 60 some degrees, so yeah, I don't know. Let me get back to fishing. Stay tuned. Slammed it. I'm about to pull it out of my hands, man. A little dinker. Those are the best eaters right there, man. Ah, look, how look how good they want it, though. Like, when they actually hit it, they're freaking choking it. That's good, dude. That's awesome. All right. I'm getting us going, boys. Come on. Rick's hooked up. That'd be a good, oh, that's a nice one. That ain't bad. Oh yeah. There it is. All the, you got all different kind of cameras. Filming, filming, <laughs> filming. <laughs> hey. GoPro's finally on. Another good eater. Choked it, it's so weird, man. It's like, the bite slows down, but then when they hit it, like, they're wanting it. Perfect eater. Oh, look at that. Pop right out. Yeah, I just threw my St. Croix down. So chunky. I need to figure out what's going on with my GoPro. Do the walleye by you guys always have that black spot back here? Right back here they do? They, up on the ear they don't, but every single one in here has that. This might be a good one. I keep saying that though. The head shakes feel good. This is heavy. Oh yeah, oh yeah. There we go. Now we're doing something. That's better. That's a better one. That's a healthy one. Don't you do it. Ah. 
There she is. That ain't a bad one there. There you go. That's better. Yeah. Much better. It's getting closer to the size I was getting yesterday. I'll probably eat him. Where the hell's he been, huh? I'm curious how big that is. I got one. He's like maybe three, three. I want to calibrate this thing. Three and a half, four pounds. That's gonna be. That's gonna be four, maybe. Maybe. Four eight seven held. Oh yeah, that's not bad. How long do you think he's like twenty? Four maybe? Point three? Point three? I don't know. Let's check where this handy dandy tool. It's going to be 23. I got to take pictures, bro. Point three. Yeah. I'm a gangster. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I finally got a good one. Just under five pounds. Super windy. Hopefully, you guys can hear me with this audio. I'm probably going to end up pulling it off the GoPro. But yeah, I've got some good fish on the stringer. Was uh, not quite as big as some of the ones I was catching last night, but it was a pretty good fish. Glad I was finally able to get a better fish. Smash this right here. I love my little swim bait. But yeah, it's been kind of slow today, though. I really need to start getting some of these hook sets on here. I need to just let my camera run. This one's gonna be a little guy. He tell by the head shakes. Well, he got a little bigger. I'm, there's no, I'm telling you, there's no place else in the world where these freaking walleye fight this hard. This guy is not even big, and he's fighting like a monster. And walleye, most places, walleye don't even fight good. He wanted it though. Oh yeah. I knew it was gonna happen. This guy got a medium action rod too. Hey, I got the stringer out already for you. Oh, dude! Oh. <laughs> That's a good one, buddy. Dude, oh yeah. Oh god. They're crazy, bro. What do you think? I'm saying four two. Bro. That's big. That's big fish, dude. Hell yeah. That's the biggest one so far. That's what I'm talking about. I think, right? What was mine? Yours was four something. Yeah, that's what I thought. It was just under five. Oh yeah, dude. Hey, Rick. Oh, that's another good one, man. That's not bad. Hey, he just caught a five pounder. Just now. You gotta hold it like this. That's how you take the picture. <laughs> it's like that. call it a day and uh this guy i could tell by as soon as it hit as soon as i felt those head shakes real long head shakes i could tell it was a big one i don't like keeping them when they're this big this fish is probably like 26 and a half inches i'm gonna go ahead and let her go try to do as graceful as release as i can with this water coming in like this all these uh all these waves oh boy i'm wet oh yeah that was a nice one there oh yeah guys boom 